Hey guys, hope you are doing well. So the US CPI data is under expectation, 0.2% under the expected, and that the number is 8.5%. So it's coming down uh, since the uh, last month, 9.1%. So let's get into, my name is Mike Dentler from Coronex, and we are bringing you the most important crypto news, static analysis, altcoin, NFT, DeFi gems every day to keep you updated and educated. I should state that nothing in this video can be considered as a financial investment advice. So everything just for your education and entertainment purposes only. So guys, smash those like, push the bell notification or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. Smashing those like, helping out the YouTube algorithm. So appreciate all your likes and let's go and check out our favorite bubble chat and you see that uh, there is nice movement bitcoin is up three percent ethereum is up eight percent and testing the 1800 to close above this is an important level and also most of the altcoins is uh, are most of the altcoins are in green especially phantom near cello uh, cell adio around Ave. so good to see that what about the crypto fear and greed index uh, let's see where it is so yesterday it was at 42 so it's really close to the neutral and now back to the 31 uh, level because yesterday we got some fear and that is why the index went uh, as low as 31 so our major news today bitcoin price sees 42,000 us dollar ethereum hits two months high as inflation shrinks okay so this is where the inflation data came out and you see that was a huge dump yesterday also dipped as low as 22,700 we made a trade we bought uh, 22,800 and now we also realized the profit at 24,000 so let's get this year on year cpi inflation came in an 8.5 percent 0.2 percent below expectations why months on months the figure was unchanged from june so this is uh how it came down and it uh, seems maybe that will be nice continuation market ha now have a pretty clear run until regional fud survey surveys in a week or so i expect those to be significantly weaker according to Rob paul peak inflation gives way to peak growth fear i don't think markets will react positively to weak growth not negatively broadly speaking okay so jewel cpi is bullish especially for tech stocks dollar dives in uh, steep as ethereum beats multi months past uh, so some of you forgot the market can pump and it's actually not be a trap especially fundamental driven like ethereum and see, uh, the dxy is lost 1.3 uh, percent and not targeting its 100 day moving average so it's going lower and lower and with this it can break down and then uh, this is a good news for uh, on risk assets next piece of news is technical analyst predicts big run for stocks bitcoin and crypto here is his timeline so uh, tech dev uh, is the analyst when equities run bitcoin runs i expect the retest equities uh, lag of the last 40 years to run into 2023 after that potentially a big test for bitcoin and crypto so this is the dollar the uh, dollar in industrial uh, dow jones industrial uh, index and average and you see this is the bitcoin price and he expect a huge run from here in a vacuum in a vacuum a bitcoin charts makes the argument for a run into 2023 a plus sideways 2023 2022 uh, 2024 correction and plus run into 2020 uh, 2025 but even the potential for 2023 secular equity stop will have me, me watching from the sidelines in 2024 to see what degree of correction we are in from. The Nasdaq's uh, first weekly true strength cross after bouncing from its 200 week exponential moving average has marked some decent Bitcoin entries over the last uh, 12 years. So Nasdaq, uh, when Nasdaq dipped and when Bitcoin um 
dipped almost the same and this is the uh, kind of RSI index over there let's go and check out my Twitter feed definitely follow me at MIKL West Dentler on Twitter and follow uh, at Corian platform and let's see Bitcoin is back to the whale accumulation zone so this is from whale map so whale accumulated Bitcoin here uh, around 20 23 uh, uh, 23 thousand US dollar and also we see these bounces where whales accumulating so good to see question is uh, will we get a bounce again to go deeper we'll see breaking us cpi data is at 8.5 percent 0.2 below expectations means inflation is cooling down so let's get this crypto guys let's go and check out what do we have here and let's see this okay so according to <coughs> the analyst uh, we see this bollinger bands and uh, bitcoin or just left the buy zone here and the, the next uh, zone is the pool zone so guys that's it for today let's go and check out our charts so bitcoin is still moving in this range in this channel and then uh, now we are uh, at the middle of the channel and there is no decision until the 24,000 uh, has not broken and it has not broken yet uh, tested the twice third this is the fourth uh, day uh, the fourth uh, test that it uh, testing to break but failed so uh, e even we will uh, see a big breakthrough here or just breaking down we'll see let's check ethereum so ethereum doing well and ethereum is on the way uh, to break the uh, 1800 us dollar levels and then uh, the next zones to watch is 2000, uh, 2200 us dollar so guys that's it for today smash those like push the bell notification and follow us on twitter at mikl west and at uh, korean platform and see you in the next video bye bye